Hello and welcome to a new day one engineers video. In this video I'll show you how to install CV Zone on your Raspberry Pi so you can quickly run computer vision packages. I'll cover the installation as well as a few examples. So let's get started. In a previous video I went over how to set up your Raspberry Pi camera on Raspberry Pi 5. Check out that video if you need to. For CV Zone we'll start by creating a Python virtual environment so let's open the command terminal and I'll make sure to create it using Python 3.11 as I've had issues with Python 3.12 when using the Raspberry Pi camera module 2 which is what I'm using. So we'll go ahead and type Python 3.11 space hyphen m space v env space hyphen hyphen system hyphen site hyphen packages space diy underscore eng. So 3.11 is to call out the version of Python we're going to be using system packages or system-wide packages is to ensure that the virtual environment has access to the system-wide package of Pi Camera 2, which we'll be needing. DIY engineering is just enable the virtual environment I'm creating. Now once created, all we need to do is type source, the name of the environment we created, slash bin, slash activate. And then you can see here, this will define the virtual environment you're now operating with it. To exit, all you have to do is deactivate. To enter it back again, do source, the same thing we just did. So now once you created the virtual environment and you're inside of it, we're going to go ahead and start installing some things. So we'll start with doing pip3 install cv zone. And this might take a while. While we wait, let's go ahead and create the following directory. So I guess it just finished. We'll create the directory anyways. On pi, create a new folder called projects. Then inside that folder, Create a new folder called CVZ for CV Zone. X out of that. We can see this successfully installed CV Zone. So now we'll do pip3 install media pipe. All right, and finally, after a while, we finish installing it. So now we're going to change directory. So we're going to do cd projects slash cvc and then from there we're gonna first open the projects folder and i place there's two codes we'll go over the hand detect so we're gonna be running this code now if you go to github.com slash cv zone you can find a lot more uh, about this module right now i'm going to show you the hand tracking module and i had to make some modifications to make it work for me because i've had issues running video capture with the raspberry pi camera 2 so instead, I'm using Pi Camera 2 and then using Pi Camp Capture Array instead of Video Capture, which is just a minor difference. Other than that, the code is the same. So take a look at GitHub CV Zone for this and a bunch of other modules, right? So for this, I'm showing you how to install it and then we'll be running the hand detect. Given I'm already in the CV Zone folder that I created, all I need to do is do Python and underscore detect dot py you can see it has my left hand and it shows clearly it shows you the nodes or components of your hand to clearly show you the gesture you're doing so you could use this for the gesture detector it's pretty good it still knows it's my left hand even though i put it upside down so now i'll switch hands and you can see that it still shows, you know, I can still detect all the components or notes of my hand, even as I change gestures. And then you can even show both hands and it can keep track of the same. It can keep the track of the distance between some of them. And you can move in real time and it will capture what it's doing. So it's pretty cool. And then I'm going to press Q to end this. So now I'll show you real quick the face detect. Again, very similar to what's shown in the CV Zone link that I showed you in GitHub, except I'm getting my images using PyCam or PyCam 2. So we'll go ahead and run face detect and I'll show you a brief example. In this case, I'm going to show an image and you can clearly see how it's detecting the face. And that percentage, the box defines where they found the face, the percentage is the confidence that it is a face. All right, let me press Q. So then I go back CD again. Deactivate to exit the virtual environment. Then I'll just close this. So this is it. As I said, go to GitHub CV Zone 
for a bunch of other modules that you can run with CVZone. So this is it. This is the video. I hope you liked it. If you did, give us a thumbs up and subscribe. See you in the next one. Bye.